then you're a whore. <laughs> Damn. And P of E. G'day, I'm Evan, and welcome hey. to Gabby Gabby Game. Joining me on the show this week, it's Kate Dennett. Woo, what does P-O-E mean? I'm proud of it. Oh, what? E. What? Uh, e. Eat. Eat. It's, a, it's like three eyes. Eat. Uh, yeah, you guys need to. You still to. said E. Yeah, I know. I don't um, need to fucking justify the way that I talk to you. Sorry, I'm just turning my phone on silent. Hello, everyone. So wait, you're a piece of ass? Is that... <laughs> <laughs> Name he is. <laughs> I'm Ben Russell. I'm Ben Russell and I'm proud. Okay. Eat. <laughs> I'm proud of it. <laughs> Do eat. Um, <laughs> I'm just a free association. <laughs> it's gonna be a good game. This is gonna be a great episode good, already. Yeah. Um, it's, uh, it's February, What's up, everybody, it's, it's February. Hot take, it's um, February. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Sorry, let's, let's Woo! just chill on the, the bullying. The <laughs> <laughs> yeah, last week was one. Um, it was. So, Are you okay? Does it hurt you? No. Oh, okay. Does it affect you? No, you I'm fine. It's only have... when we stopped filming and then Xavier said something rude. And I was like, hey, yeah. this is all for show. Yeah, oh. behind the scenes, Xavier was bullying everybody. <laughs> I know you're all joking, it's fine. Yeah, right. <laughs> um, February means that if you sign up to our Patreon this month, uh, you get, a, you get a, a little gaming game pin. I don't have one on me, sorry. But you've seen them, you know what they look like. It's a... Um, it's the logo, Lucas. It's just the logo on a pin. <laughs> get over it. Pretty low effort, really. Why are you insulting our viewers? <laughs> <laughs> Very tired. Um, uh, maybe if you didn't. I reached delirium like four days ago. And <laughs> maybe I if you didn't go out here. on the town and drink and do drugs. <laughs> Listen to your father. Uh, <laughs> if you sign up to the uh, ten dollars tier. I had two glasses of water, you bitch. Water is that what the kids are calling it these days? <laughs> ten dollars tier or higher. Of e. In yes. <laughs> you get a you get a pin. All right. Um, <laughs> Uh, I want to thank uh, some new people who signed up to our Patreon uh, <gasps> just this you. last thank week. Thank you so much. Um, I, but I don't know how to pronounce... Uh, I don't know Why didn't you on. look it up? Uh, Nestor... I guess I didn't care that much. Guijaro. Oh, Nestor Guijaro. Oh, I do, yeah. I care about everybody. I'm, I'll just do my best effort. Uh, yeah. Oisin O'Sullivan? Nestor... Guijaro? 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 You reckon? Okay. Maybe. Um, I could, could be wrong, something. Nestor, in which case I'm... Sorry. Um, Katrina Mark. Not another apology. Um, Jamil Nawaz and uh, Dale Ball. So thank oh, you. Yeah. A lot of new up. faces, which means um, it will be getting on you guys have been breaking our rules. What's the rules? Don't talk about gamey gaming. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a rule. This is what people do. Um, <laughs> it's funny. Dale Ball this week joined the Discord and then didn't say Who anything. Who is he? Mm -hmm. Okay. His because his Discord name is Delay, I think. D L A E. Oh, um, why don't you, why don't you dox him? I'm not doxing yeah, him. Yeah, just say his address, like, what? <laughs> where's this going at? Why are you this having a go with Discord username is more personal than address it, and phone number. Wait. Why? Evan has a great story, I'm sure. No, it's not a great story. It's just <laughs> the, the, the Discord for the last, like, 24 hours has just been people hounding him for not saying anything. So... This doesn't sound like a friendly place to be. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's right. Well, when you create... A culture, that's what happens. Yeah. Mm. Uh, Dale, if you want to just go on the Discord and say something, I'm sure people oh will be uh, this is excited. It's such a weird to personal hello. call out. No, like, you you're not say, pulling your weight. We just, we just wanted to say hello. Maybe he just wants to observe. Why do you need him to speak <laughs> yeah. up? Yeah. yeah. All right. Sometimes people are lurkers and that's all they want. Okay, to that's fine. It's up to you, Dale. Under the radar. Um, Dale, at me and I'll give you Evan's home address. <laughs> 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 and that can be your first <laughs> 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 this week we're going to take a look at Kentucky Route Zero, but first, uh, what do you think of this? The, the, the creator of Stardew Valley uh, revealed on Twitter... Man after working, my own heart! He's uh, working on a new game in the same universe, but it's not a farming game. Uh, he obviously underestimated his fans' excitement because after a flurry of press and online chatter, he tweeted again, um, he said... Um, I see this blowing up and there are articles coming out, etc. All I ask is please don't get too hyped at this stage. I want to avoid too much hype or speculation. I'd just like to make whatever game comes naturally to me without too much pressure or expectation. I'm not setting out to make the next, in uh, next indie smash hit. I just want to make another game that I enjoy and I'm happy with. 
and to share some of my art and ideas with the world. If it becomes popular, I will be happy, but it's not my focus. Well, what let me just say, it. I am hyped! <laughs> this is said to be the next Hit indie smash <laughs> game. What a, what a nice man. It is yeah, yeah. Be popular, and I can't wait for it. I feel like we're it's it's against his wishes to be talking about it at all. Yeah. Eric Barone. He is an anti-capitalist bitch. Yeah. Eric, get down from here. This man was my number one artist on Spotify of the decade. Oh really? That's well, crazy. Because I used to have Stardew Valley <laughs> soundtrack as my alarm. Oh, Does he do the soundtrack? Do, 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 he, tre- do. he did everything for yeah, that yeah, game right. for Stardew Valley. He composed all the music. He did it wow. all, and it was cool because most of the music was calm. There was only one like where some characters form a rock band. That if that was the song that randomly came on to wake me up, it was mm. very distressing. But other than <laughs> that, it was good. It was just this one song was like. But otherwise, great work. Um, are you hyped for a, a I'm game? So the, the oh, I'm so hyped. I'm so hyped. What would it be if it wasn't farming? What could it possibly space. be? Space. I hope it's a space digging one. I like those mineral resources games. Oh, yeah, like StarCraft. Yeah. No, oh. no. Like <laughs> StarCraft? <laughs> like Yeah, you do you mine resources and then you... Well, I've never right. played that. I wouldn't dare. Oh. So you're <laughs> okay. a drill and you go drilling and you're like, I need ore, different types of ore, and then you collect your ore no and then you go back sky? to the... Uh, no, I've not played. Uh, no, like way more basic, like a flash Journey game. The there was this flash oh. game that I played once in high school and I want to play it again. And I reckon he could do it. He's the man to do it. Oh, he can't. Flash is dead. Uh, Flash is dead, yeah. Yeah, Chrome's dropping Flash December 2020. I keep getting notifications. Sorry, dude. Because I play a lot of Flash games still. But you know what I'm talking about? Those, like, space games where you're, like, a little space drill and you're, like, mining for stuff on a space rock? No. I mean, I know the sorts of games you mean, but I don't... Worms? Are you talking about worms? (laughs) No, I'm not talking about worms. Worms is different. Yeah. Worms are different. Um, you I, in there. I reckon he'd do come out. I well, good on him. Keep on, keep it on, my man. Yeah. You should play a game. I think it's called Starbound. Starbound. Okay. I'll confirm that in just a moment. Mm. But it's like, uh, yeah, it's kind of like that Stardew, but Minecrafty. Go down, mine shit. Go to a, get fuel for your ship. Go yep. off. It's available on Steam. I just want to dig. And then yeah, go to the can, surface again. I don't want to do build anything. Once. No, though. You, but their purpose is to... Lemmings. No, no you again, can't. No. You can't. Okay. This you can dig to your heart's content. Great. I just want a digging sim, I think. I, um, <laughs> I think I can... I, I understand. Digging simulator. Please make it happen. <laughs> this guy. I, um, I can see where Eric is coming from with this because... Is this the kind of pressure you face with gaming any game? <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, but with, like, hype is often what, well, what can kill a AAA game sometimes is mm. mm. you get too hyped for something and then they inevitably disappoint. So I can see see his, um, and imagine working on a small project on your own, a little indie game, and it's just you working on something and having the immense pressure, like. Well, here's the good news, Evan. Yes. This man clearly has enough money to live. Yeah. And he's not going to be pressured into be into releasing a game by anyone because he does it all himself. So shove it. Right. This. And that's a promise. <laughs> Thank you. It might be space. <laughs> might be. Sounds like Eric's what your daddy. What else would it be? He is my daddy. He's my zaddy. What's the zaddy? Never mind. <laughs> 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 I had a very big conversation with Rebecca Vitratis about zaddies. Really? What's a zaddy? It's a, fas- a, it's a fashionable daddy, right? When people are like, yes, daddy, like that kind of sexy, <laughs> that's it, right? That's Eric Barone. Yeah. I have just started, someone was like, hey, you got to get uh, Dream Daddy. Oh, yeah. Dream Daddy. We've talked about that on this show Too before. much reading, to be honest. And <laughs> yeah. liking. Yeah. There was a lot of reading. A lot of daddies, though. A lot of daddies, though. I if like If you want a game with a mm. bunch of daddies. Check Dream Daddy out. Is that the daddy dream? That's a dream. The yeah, daddy, you're a dad. Daddy, you want to go and you want to fuck. You want to. You want to fuck other dads. There's all mm. kinds of dads as well. Yeah, I mean that's that's true in yeah. life. Yeah, yeah. There are all those daddies out there, you know, and they're just waiting <laughs> to get fucked. Oh, and they're standing there. They're, <laughs> they're, figures. they're standing there. They got their baby just hanging off their chest. Yeah. So good. Yeah, there are a lot of hot dads. Uh, out there, and they're just re- they're waiting for your call right now. <laughs> in my area? <laughs> yeah, hot dads in your area, <laughs> and they're waiting. 
<laughs> what are they waiting for? But <laughs> when they fucking figure that out, we're all doomed. They'll take over. Their dads? Yeah, their dads will take over and we'll be ruled by dads and, and that's it. we are ruled by dads. What? Yes. No, but we're ruled by yes. dads. Yes. But not daddies. Important. And we're not ruled by daddies. No. We're not ruled by zaddies. No. Finally, this show gets some credibility. Yeah, I don't want to get political on us. Going but. near the real issues here. We are all Daddies serious. run the world. Is Evan a daddy? <laughs> this has been talked about on the show before. I don't know. <laughs> um. <laughs> Dale Ball, you found your first post. <laughs> Daddy's angry. <laughs> yeah, just write that. Somebody's um, got to go to their room. <laughs> uh, Kentucky Route Zero is a, a story-driven point-and-click adventure game. Mm. It was originally launched uh, on Kickstarter nine years ago. What? Uh, yeah, with each of the five acts being released as they were completed. Uh, the game was finally completed in January. Uh, so what better time to take a jump in and have a look at it. Um, can someone uh, let's see the, the pass trailer me my, real quick. My pen. Trailer real quick. Oh, Bex, can someone pass me yes. my pen? That was a look at the trailer for Kentucky Route Zero. Uh, so, uh, <laughs> that's funny, I mean, that's one of your funniest jokes. Uh, I think it was good, I think you've got legs. Say it again. That was a look at the trailer for Kentucky Route Zero. Yes! <laughs> 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 All right. Um, so... Uh, I played a bit of this game. Squir uh, squirt it on me. Oh, squirt it on me, Evan. Wait, so oh. it's nine years old. It's nine years, well, yeah. And it just got finished. Squirt it yeah, on Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, it's just been a, a, a long, long time coming, long time in development. Wait, so when did it first, the first thing get released? Uh, t uh, maybe 2013, I think, from memory. Mm. That is seven years ago, my friend. Yeah, no shit. Um, Gee as chi, my D. Gee as chi? Guilty as, as charged, my <laughs> dude. I'm starting to learn. Um, <laughs> so I don't think it's a problem with Evan needing to learn. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's where the miscommunication lies. Listen, yeah. don't... Don't you take the blame for this, Evan. <laughs> don't. This is my slang, okay? Your slay? In. In. Slang. Slang, sorry. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, this um, is Ben Russell Spee. Yeah. <laughs> Um, so, <laughs> you're, uh... That's the way I like it, man. It's your perfect speed. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Thank you. I no, just, the, for the um, first time, I think this will be incomprehensible. <laughs> 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 it's purely for my own enjoyment. <laughs> um, you start off at a, at a, a gas station. Um, mm, I've been the, there. The <laughs> <laughs> I think we've all been there. You know yeah, I mean? hell yeah. yeah. Hell yeah, dude. Even if you don't the... drive, you've probably been there. Like, yeah. To a gas station. Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. We're all working up on the side of a highway. Yeah. <laughs> Walking by, you need a bloody big big milk. What? Milk! <laughs> uh, it's presumably... the first thing that comes out of your mouth when you wake up on a highway. <laughs> Look, he's, he's there, he's got his dog. Like Jason Derulo himself. 
<laughs> she said the rule needs milk. And cats, he just yells about milk a lot. Yeah, I oh. love cats. There's a point that in the song funny. where he just goes, milk! So. Mm, I know. And they went, to, okay, okay, quickly, sorry, side, yep. side sidebar. Side bar. Uh, in cats, all the cats are on the street, right? But all the shops are cat puns. So does that mean that, are there cat shops, mm, mm -hmm. are they for people? Are they or run by people or are they run by or cats? Are they run by cats? In which case, these cats, why are they out in the streets at night? Are they big Are shops? there other big cats? Yeah, they're big shops. Okay, so it's not like the cats are like, here I come in. I'm but also they're quite shopping. big cats. They know? can get in. I don't know if you've heard, but Jason Derulo is always on the wrong side of every door and he has to get through it. Oh. Yeah. I mean, out of everything, this bothered me the most. <laughs> Yeah, right. Is the world, would they, are they like some sort of subculture of cats? It in sounds a, like. In a world of cats? It sounds like the art, the, the production designer was just like, this will be funny. <laughs> right. I won't worry about the lore. I'm just going to make it like cat. Like yeah, I they, worry about like the lore cat. constantly. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Just keeps you up at night. Yeah. That's where your high blood pressure comes from. <laughs> yeah, it's lore. Cat's lore. Yeah. <laughs> uh. There's a you, you got a, you got a dog in a straw hat? Well, that's the last thing on our minds. <laughs> um, so uh, it sort of, it sort of kicks you off there. So you're driving a, um, you're basically, you're a, you're, you've got a truck, you're, you're a delivery driver for um, Lizette's Antiques. Mm. Um, and you're, you're looking for an address. Five Dogwood Drive. Yes. You're looking for Dogwood Drive. Mm -hmm. Um, what happens next? You, uh, it's up to you. Well, look, you you stop t you stop at this uh, gas station to try and uh, get some help from the the attendant there. Maybe he can Joseph. You, Joseph, yeah, maybe yeah. he can point you. Yeah. Uh, he rocks. Or Joseph, if uh, he's Greek, he could yeah, be a Greek yeah. man. Yeah, yeah. It is all it is all um, it. you know. All the dialogue is just text on screen. He's sort of clicking through it. There's no. Um, voiceover or you know acting or anything like no, that. No, I mean um, you have been quoted earlier on this episode as saying that you hate reading. Mm. Um, yes. Can I comment? Still, yes. <laughs> what is it about reading that confuses you? The fact that you can't do it? Or? <laughs> <laughs> you ableist bitch! Um, I just, it just sometimes it takes too long for me. I just, I'm like, can something happen? Is this all gonna, gonna I could read a book. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Can this, you? This is. <laughs> <laughs> I could try. Um, this is like a book that you can, you know, interact with. Well, yeah, I, mean, I would do this before I'd read a book. But in a way, everything is like a book that you can interact with. <laughs> you know, this Oreo <laughs> packet is a book that I can interact with. Like, yeah, it's like sure. A book. It's like a cylinder book. But what's the story that it's trying to tell? Uh, there are Oreos. <laughs> okay. It's not a great book. It's a short book. In book club, I would give this. Maybe a two star, but right. the fact that it's delicious, <laughs> that bumps it up another two more stars. So that's four yeah. stars. Wow, well, okay. So. But this, it has uh, value beyond being a book. Yeah. This is a cup, for instance. I'm reading this. That's got a great story. Look yeah. at that story. <laughs> yeah. But also, on top of a good story, it tastes great. And that taste is up to me. It's like a choose your own adventure. Sure. Because you know, I, I can put anything I want. Mm. I could put Coca Cola. I could put yeah. a. I could put a gin. I mean, I what about vodka. Kate's shirt? My shirt. As that is a book. Yeah, it's a picture book. Mm. <laughs> 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 um, Checkmate <Yes>. B. <laughs> so, um, so yes, it's it's uh, obviously a lot of it is is clicking through, and, and you, you know you've got the, the dialogue tree, you're selecting your responses to people. Yeah. Um, uh, and then, you, but you're also you're, it, you're kind of in this sort of 3D-ish world, you know. It's sort of these these scenes that you can. I love the art style. Yeah, the art style. It looks really beautiful. Mm -hmm. I feel like a lot of the um, you know development always, time has, has gone into yeah. just making it look real, real nice. Annapurna. Annapurna. They've done yeah. something else. I love the art style of. Uh, yes. Can I tell you what it is? Yeah, no. no. Okay. Do they make Why? Florence? Oh, yeah, yeah, Florence. Yeah, you keep. You've said that many times. You know. Well, not what, what you love. You've gone on that you love Florence. Yeah, I like Florence. In fact, okay. Beck, I'm gonna. Uh, we'll go through all Don't that footage do and do a flashback right now. <laughs> it is gonna have it on file whenever I've talked about Florence. Um, footage not found. Just say Ben's, just say Ben's a liar. It's fine. No one cares. 
Gotcha. If I wasn't mid-spiral right now, I think I would have a really fun time just sitting back and relaxing and playing this game. Mm, yeah. As of now, I have too much stuff going on in my head mm, that I'm like, you want me to read this wall of text? <laughs> Pay me, bitch. <laughs> okay. So, uh, let me invoice you. How much? Uh, I'm offering you 20. 20 bucks. <laughs> Pay how much of it? All of it. All of it. No. No? Okay, 20 I'll, bucks. I'll go find someone else who'll be interested in. I'll do it. Great, win win. All right, $20. Great. Right. Right. Your trash is another man's treasure. Exactly, and that's how the industry works. That's kids. right. There's always going to be someone there that's going to undercut you. Yep. I'm just <laughs> going to take that work for cheap. Who got undercut? I did. <laughs> no, you did. I'm not sure what undercut means. I just said no. <laughs> <laughs> said it wasn't funny, it's when you get one of those uh, 90s yeah. hairstyles where yeah, yeah. so they do that. <laughs> Little bowl cut. No, a little yeah, a bowl cut, but there's a layer underneath. Yeah, it's a little... free. It's a Devon Sawa. It's a classic. Good All if right. you've got really thick hair. Oh, I didn't hmm. know that. I got thickens. Yeah, but it's short, so it's not gathering at the back. It's yeah. a little too much wave. You will be a strange beast if yeah, you do it. Yeah, I got a lot of wave going on. But I'm going to grow it out, guys. You watch. Really? How yeah. far? Have I you don't decided know. this earlier or just now? No, I've, I decided maybe two days ago, to oh. be honest. I was like, yeah, I could get a haircut or I could just grow this bitch out, get this... past the awkward phase, mm. the teenage years of the hair, mm. and then uh, get into the sweet, wavy goodness. You guys watch, I'm going to be a fucking... Yeah. Uh, so if you want to follow this, along week to week. Is this before or during your sleep deprivation phase? Mm, this is during. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's a breakdown, my friend. Whoops. <laughs> 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 uh, a breakdown. <laughs> Okay, so you, uh, it, it's, it's got a very sparse soundscape, but yes, it looks um, looks beautiful. Um, Love a sparse soundscape. It's just like you. You got a sparse soundscape. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. That's so exactly. rude. Um, what do you mean? <laughs> Is that rude? But he's, he looks good. It didn't seem like he was being mean. It seemed like... Okay. It was, it was kind of a backhanded compliment. <laughs> <laughs> um, so... Like, or, it's a neg. Yeah, all right. All right. How, did all right. How did it make Evan. you feel, Evan, when he said that to you? Horny. Uh, horny. <laughs> That's what the book tells me. Be mean. Quick, do some magic, and he's in. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so um, bar magic. Does magic, it? you can do it bar. <laughs> I carry little pieces of magnesium with me. Who? <laughs> 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 the, um, you know, if you want to, uh, if you have like problems with uh, like eye spasms, have some magnesium. So that's I had some last good. night yeah, to help me eat, relax before bed. Eat it up. Oh. Did not work. Spinach. <clears throat> Spinachios. Mm. Okay, so you. Um, <laughs> this is bad. You you no, find it's you, good. <laughs> you find out that to find Dogwood Drive, uh, you Spoilers. need to find. Well, no, I mean this is. Spoilers! Very, you're gonna. You have to find a street. You have to find, uh, you have to find, plot point. you have to find route zero. Oh. Which is, it's oh, in the time. Tell me about it. What about, what about <laughs> route 66? Because I've been there. <laughs> route zero, this am I right? You're on route 65, you're in Kentucky. Because <laughs> you're um, rooting so it. So it's not just a clever name. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, Evan, <laughs> yes. this looks spooky. Oh, yeah. Is it? <laughs> Spooky. <laughs> it is spooky. It is uh, spooky. Um, there's, there's. They, I don't they, see myself as like an erotic writer, or <laughs> a, um, like an erotic junglist, you know. Yeah. yeah. They, Have you? Sorry. <laughs> it is a bit spooky. Sorry, Evan. One right, second. Okay. We'll get back to the spookiness. I promise. All right. Uh, Kate, have you ever done erotic fiction, erotic <laughs> fan fiction before? No. Would you consider? I will for a price. Twenty bucks. <laughs> Twenty bucks. I'll yeah. write a horny paragraph. Would you ever? Do you think you'd ever do a collab with, like, say, puppetry of the penis or something? No, like no, I'd never collab. Uh, okay. Could no. you do some erotic fan fiction for a gamey gamey game? <laughs> <laughs> if I get paid, oh! I would. I would. <laughs> but none, none of you guys are in it. <laughs> what about them? Want it to be erotic? <laughs> what? <laughs> that is so rude. It would, that is rude. It would be obtuse. Right, I'd stories about Someone us gives you $20. fucking something. <laughs> no, I'm not going to I'm not gonna write about you guys fucking. Good. That's a line I don't want to cross. Not each other. <laughs> yeah, that would be weird. Just That's something else. That's insane. If this whole time I've been writing sick stories about people I know in my life. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> and I've changed no one's name. <laughs> <laughs> 
are all in relationships. And I've just made all these assumptions about your bodies as well. <laughs> what the fuck? Ben's weird little nipples <laughs> float gently in the breeze. They're long like spaghetti. <laughs> well, we've seen them. That's a given. Um, no, this is a given. <laughs> <laughs> it's um, so it's creepy. Oh. You're creepy. No, you're not. You're actually beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Um, it is a bit creepy. That, that you're really backing that, out of the bullying. It's not creepy. <laughs> I don't want to say creepy. No, you're not creepy. No. The there are um, many things. That's not creepy the joke. Is not one of them. Thank you. Apart from when you said you wanted to fuck a dog last week. Yeah, that was, <laughs> I didn't say that at all. That was weird. Well, I asked, well, you I, brought I, up. You I asked, asked the, the question. <laughs> That's I all. am putting <laughs> that in the next one. <laughs> Tell it to the Evan judge. Uh, fucks a dog. No. And Evan fucks this uh, little. Oh, okay. Dog, erotic. No, no, no. Fan right. fiction no, for gamey, gamey, gamey. No, gamey. because I don't. Oh, I don't want to write about your dog. That's I don't fine. Want about, what about fifty? Sh- I don't want to write. Fifty and Tazo. Yeah, right. Because they have some like. They they they're always at each other, but it's yeah. like it would be like in Mr. and Mrs. Smith. They're like, ah, okay, you're good go to go. That's your story. You can have that one. <laughs> no, that's true. That's your story. The worst part is I am sweating so much that I'm talking about this erotic fan fiction, and like, you're getting really <laughs> wiped out, wiping all this sweat off. <laughs> oh, is it getting hot? In? <laughs> I don't write <laughs> about you guys. Okay, <laughs> uh, you are keep wiping wrong. that upper lip. <laughs> And once you told me that when you lie, you sweat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like 13 degrees outside. Right it's, <laughs> it's a bit creepy. The, um, the, they, they play with sort of light and shadow um, at, at various points. Uh, you have, a, you, you're given a, a, a torch that you can turn on and off at, at various points and they can mm-hmm. um, reveal different things. There's a point where you're in a mine, underground in a mine, and you're on like a, a cart thing. You love that. And um, a mine. Being in the mines. Oh, in the dark. You, you're a digger. Digging. Oh, yeah. you're a natural you're not, digger. That's why you got <laughs> oh, I see what we're doing. That's why <laughs> you got up. Yep. I that's why you got big in a really horny way. <laughs> that's awful now. And if <laughs> Me you, being like, make a story about digging. Uh, <laughs> so you, you're on a mine cart and it's like sparking, right? And you got your light, and if you turn your light off, then it, 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 it's pitch black, but then it lights up. The spark lights up, oh. and and then it lights up. And, oh. then, then, and, and then and then and it's fine and then it lights oh. up again and then there's <gasps> some some figures there very oh. briefly and then it lights up and they're gone. Oh. What are the ghouls? Why are they? <laughs> Why I don't know. are they? So I I haven't gotten <laughs> enough into the story to know Why exactly what's going ghouls, on. Why are ghouls, Evan? But it's definitely a um definitely a, a, a ghost story of some sort going on here. Mm. <laughs> um uh, which Ooh. is you know there's a, a bit of intrigue there. Um there was a flood. What? There was a flood and not all the miners could get out. That's right. Uh, yeah. I nice. Guess the, I guess it's well the, done. That's what this story's about, isn't it? Um, I don't know. I've had a lot past. I think there's a lot. There's a lot of. Uh, is yeah. that a spoiler in this game? I don't know. I don't know. It's in the first act. You don't even yeah. know what it is, so you can't. Well, that everything's a spoiler. Ham. There's another uh, spoiler. <laughs> the, uh, My mother. <laughs> spoiler. spoiler. There's uh, cats. Um, spoiler. There's, uh, Stevie. Stevie Dean. That's the, fine. Stevie's fine. Stevie's fine. Oh. We love Stevie. Stevie. Uh, Shout out to Stevie Dean. Shout out to Stevie Dean. Stop doing all those dangerous stunts. Your mother worries about (laughs) you. There's another point uh, down the mine where, um, so there's a a reel-to-reel tape player down there and it, uh, because of the the power is inconsistent, which seems to be a theme so far, um, it only works when you turn the light off. (laughs) So you turn the light off and then this creepy reel-to-reel tape uh, of, of music apparently recorded by archivists of, uh, of the miners performing music underground. It's kind of surreal. Was this, in the first, was this in the first act? Because I didn't get any of this. Yes, this is in the first act. But it's also it's one of the things that. You <laughs> can... <laughs> Did you yeah. do that? Yeah. Here, ready? Thank you. Did you do the turntable <laughs> thing in the mind? Yes! Okay, great. I, know, yes. I did not see any spooky, ooky people. Right, I okay. Just there's, I think th- there's a lot. Found in... helmets. Yeah, right, I didn't find helmets. So that sounds like it's, good, huh? Thank you. You can certainly, <laughs> if you explore enough, you'll obviously find uh, a lot more stuff. Um, that's what they say. That's what they say, uh, but you don't necessarily have to in order to sort of proceed through the story. 
Um, now, do you solve puzzles like a click adventure sh story? Yeah, there's there's puzzles. Or maybe you had a, you came across a puzzle was the very yep. first thing that you did in the game. Yeah, and I was like, up. what am I supposed to do? And everyone was like, read, bitch. <laughs> so I read, and then I solved a tiny little puzzle, and then I said, I get it. Yeah. And then I came down here and I put the <laughs> mic on, and away we go. <laughs> huh. um, yes, there are little puzzles like that. Um, Is yeah. this just on computer? No, it's on so many oh, things. Look. It's on. Uh, oh, it's on Switch. Yeah, it's on. Switch. Oh yeah, I'll probably get it then. Okay, it's on. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> no one cares. <laughs> <laughs> it's on PlayStation, Xbox, PC. Jesus uh, Christ. It's on uh, Mac and Linux and uh, and stuff. Just PS4, watch your tone. Xbox, so, so <laughs> lots of um, different. Uh, Can you believe this guy? Things. Don't I love a, love a bit of Linux. Whatever is going on here. Linux? No, no. Linux. <laughs> you ever worked with Linux? No. no. I've done. No, I've not that's worked a trap. with it. It's often I've... a trap. <laughs> I, I, I like Linux, but I usually I'll no. play with it, and then <laughs> and then it, I, I run into things that I can't do because yeah. I need Windows, and it's like, oh, well, that was fun. I'm quite stupid, so I tried mm. to do. I was like fucking around with it, and then because everything is made of Linux, isn't it? Isn't it Linux is. Yeah, well, man. The fabric of life itself? Well, <laughs> yes. well Unix yes. is like the, the, the base of Linux and, uh, and Mac OS and Android, I think, is Unix. Mm. Um, so that it has that sort of common... It's cool, um, I like it. Yeah, okay. You like um, Linux? I like all the... I like, I like the fact that it's there. Yeah, I like but it. But I don't know anything about it, you know? Yeah. It's like the breeze. You could use Ubuntu. That's a, a good free like starting point. Um, what? Zimbabwe. Ubuntu. Ubuntu? Why would you? <laughs> Why would you? Well, it's a free alternative. Why would you? Windows. Ubuntu. Yeah. That's the ad. <laughs> <laughs> the only people I know who have Ubuntu and Linux and all that shit are big nerds. Yeah, That's all I'm case saying. in point. Nerdy, yeah. Aren't you a fucking software engineer? No, not anymore. I I tailed it, bitch. You left it all behind you. I left it behind. Yeah, now look yeah. at me. I don't know if it works like that. Sweating in Brunswick. <laughs> Once a software With a cup engineer, of chamomile tea. Always and a, Coke a software zero. engineer. You never hang up your mouse. Home always <laughs> has a way. Yeah. Put yeah, it back I, in. I am a woman of STEM. What? They'll never take that away from me. Yeah. Um, you, I think you would like this, Naomi, if you, if you kept playing it. I'm going to play it. Um, it reminded me Prove a bit it. of... Um, I, well, not now. Kind of similar to like Life is Strange, except Life is Strange is a lot more like um, cinematic, I guess. Like yeah. it's, it's actually acted out. It's got... Um, uh, Pretty good scenes. soundtrack. It doesn't really have that. Yes, great soundtrack, whereas this one uh, doesn't... It's got sparse. It's got sparseness. Sparse sound. I yeah. really like the sound design of this one. I'm into it. Yeah, I like it too, yeah. I'm into the appearance. Did I it like speak you? Um, no, but I like the vibe. I like that melancholy, mm. like, you're sitting back, it's raining outside, you don't have any friends anymore. <laughs> <laughs> it you're playing this game. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you're thinking about, like, maybe I should take the car out. And you're like, no, I'll play this game instead. <laughs> take the car out? Yeah, to go up the mountain. Just go for a little drive? For, a little for drive. the sake of the car? Like, the think. car needs How's to get out? You to think about your You're family. still alone. You don't see them anymore. <laughs> it felt like a... It felt a that kind of, of shit, you know? You yeah. can't... Drive the that, loneliness away. You know you're what in I'm that saying? kind of a mood, but you don't want to like do anything about it. Yeah. You play this game. Would you say that you're married to the road? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Hell yeah. It Absolutely. Felt, um, the road is my life. I mm. felt a bit like a dream. Wow. This um, the vibe, like it's it's sort of a bit sort of mysterious. Yes, and because if you tried to explain this to someone, you'd be like, and then there was this thing, and you had to like drive around, and there was like a crystal, but you had to turn around. At the right. Wind. So it is like a The dream. crystal, that whole so thing, it was kind of confusing. Once you get onto I the liked zero, the vibe, though. I yeah. liked it. I liked that they're clearly pulling from like, like these people have rich lives outside of work. Mm. I liked that they were pulling from that. Mm -hmm. What's your top three vibes? Oh. Winter time. Yep. Mm. Um... Uh, that point in a night where everyone gets too drunk before it flips into chaos, but it seems like something crazy is about to happen, but it hasn't flipped just mm -hmm. yet. I yep. love that vibe. Um, like when everyone's just dropped or something. You know? Yeah, more like a... It's just before though. Yeah, not so much drugs, but like drunk, like... That well, kind of right before okay. the dance before they drop, off. right before they. Alcohol is actually the most dangerous drug of all. <laughs> what about heroin? <laughs> <laughs> Still, 
Do you guys want to go do some heroin after this? Yeah, why not? I would love to do some big H. Mm. <laughs> um. <laughs> uh, my top three vibes. Oh. She did. Oh, she only sorry. said two. Oh. Okay, sorry. Please continue. I thought heroin was one of them. <laughs> That's you. I've never tried heroin. I <laughs> I've don't never know. Tried <laughs> Why um, do you say that? You're be, like insecure. Uh, about comment it. Below no, I'm like, I've never heroin. tried heroin. <laughs> no, I just haven't tried. It might be one of them. I just, you know, I'm not insecure about it. I've just never shot heroin into my face before. <laughs> I reckon if I get virgin, <laughs> if I get to eighty. Yep. <coughs> Big if there. Yep. <laughs> but if I get to 80, I'm going to fucking... You're going to some... die from heroin? <laughs> I'm going to get some heroin and I'm going to... I'm gonna die. I'm not going to shoot die. it up. You're going to die from heroin at 80. Yeah. Did you... Ever... <laughs> huh? Did you ever find out if vaping's killing you yet? Uh, at the moment, no. Well, good good news. Everyone at else has found out about it. And <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's not true. <laughs> Hopcorn lung. Popcorn lung. Popcorn lung. <laughs> just just put two words. Uh, uh, crazy scary. bird. It's scary as hell, though. Crazy bird. Yeah, exactly. Bird? Guys, we're not exactly. having a fight about vaping. <laughs> what is your third vibe? My third vibe is... I don't know what my third vibe is. What's your third vibe? I don't even have a first vibe. <laughs> this is um, not it. So I know that much. Does it, have to be, does it have to be different from the first two? Because just rain. Nature and rain. Yeah, sure. No, no. Okay. Just Crazy I like, vibe. I like, I like, I don't like summer. I like every other month around it. Summer okay. is hell for me. Mm. Uh, my top three vibes are spooky window. Ooh. Uh, crazy oh. legs. Nice. And <laughs> nice. Simple dreams. <laughs> <laughs> top three. Um, Greatest no. vibes of all time. Uh, don't uh, at me. Can you repeat them? <laughs> crazy, uh, spooky window, uh -huh. crazy legs, simple dream. Wow. Nice. I, I am like impressed that, that you yeah, were you know how I can repeat that? Because I did not plan, I planned that, I knew that, uh, real things. I've been approaching the vibes in the wrong way. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Well, that's the greatest thing about vibes, you can yeah. approach them any which way, you know what I'm saying? There's yes. no wrong way. What's your yeah. top three vibes? When something's funny. First vibe. Good vibe. First vibe. Second vibe, walking outside, nice breeze. Nice breeze, oh, that's, that's a great vibe. Third vibe, full party time, party time. Full party time Ooh, is a great hell vibe. hell yeah. Three great vibes. Evan, what's your top three vibes? Uh, all right. Um, uh, just sitting at home on my own watching TV, it's nice. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> going to the movies, uh -huh. that's nice. Yeah. Um, <gasps> Doing this shit. <laughs> Kevin, you basic bitch. <laughs> <laughs> vibe check. Evan's off and he's done. Get him out of here. Bad vibes. Sitting, Sitting at, at home. home alone. <laughs> alone. Watching TV. That's nice. What, free to air we're talking here? No. <laughs> What's Beck doing? <laughs> something yeah. on, something on my Amazon My favourite vibe is not including my significant Amazon other Prime. It's yeah, the good wife. The good wife or something. <laughs> Sitting at home. I'm sorry, he Sitting at home alone watching the good wife. Yep. Um, <laughs> I, uh, I was frustrated by the, the, I guess, the intentionally frustrating bureaucracy of the, the start of the second act. Um, yes. A, <laughs> so there's... you were still talking about the good wife. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> <laughs> We still talking about the good wife you here. Know, there like the the bureaucracy. You know, like character traits for Evan. Everything deep down is actually about the good wife. So he's talking about this, but he's really talking about the good wife. When he's talking to you about games, but he's really thinking about that good wife. <laughs> she could have been gooder <laughs> and wifier. She's a flawed character. <laughs> oh man, it's too hot in here. Okay, what did you think of uh, Kentucky Route Zero? Um, I liked it. Good uh, switch. Yes. And um, thank you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I really liked it. I think, like, you can't, I don't know, it's one of those games that you, I don't think you should apply, like, rules on. Like, I don't think what? you should. That's so brave. <laughs> so you're saying is you want to send this game to, like, a Montessori? Um, yeah. Steiner school. <laughs> Steiner school, yeah. Oh, right. You want to send you're the game to this game Yeah. You run just, around. Just let this go. Game. Excuse me, your game is shitting on my carpet. I know that's just what this it's game does. This game does. <laughs> yeah, let this game this become artist. a nightmare. We don't use the word no. <laughs> this game is going to become a nightmare adult. Um, yeah. 
it's um, I don't know. Like I also I think I've been um, I think that I don't know. I've got a lot of thoughts. You can say them. Yeah. Okay. This is kind um, of the perfect place. Yeah, so this is, your time. <laughs> this is your platform. Okay. I don't want to talk your ears off with my opinions <laughs> about the game, but <laughs> so I loved Lucas Art Games. That's how I entered mm -hmm. gaming. Yep. Right? Which one? What's that? Uh, I loved uh, Dig. Yes. I think that one had the biggest impact. <laughs> you love digging. Love dig. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> all of those. Oh God, it's all connected. <laughs> From that era. How did the... that? How is this a shock to you? <laughs> <laughs> all you've been talking about is digging. I know. I love digging so much. Yeah. It's all I can think about. Dig. How I wish I had a backyard so I could just dig all the time. <laughs> Dig full throttle. Just walk upon Kate. Just yeah, 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 yeah. Full throttle. <laughs> oh, man. Max. Yeah, yeah, the whole lot. Like I, I was. That was <laughs> me. Like I was. That was me. Me too. Grim I Fandango. I love it. I never played that one. Ah, uh, it's fucking so good. And they've re-released it, and it's uh, on consoles and everything. So yeah, I just. So I entered this being like, it's actually been fucking ages since I've played a game like that. So mm. I'm, I'm gonna probably like this no matter what. I think I decided to like it before I went in. Right. So, um. Whilst there are like yeah, the bureau bu it's a word on a video bureau, say, bureau, bureau. stuff. Yeah. Has, was a little bit tedious. I was still just like, well, that's like my recollection of these games is like there are weird little areas that you get stuck in and like yeah. whatever. Mm. I am still playing Disco Elysium. Yeah. Still on it. Wow. I haven't played Disco Elysium, but uh, it's like this, right? Yeah. But it's sort of so dense. Like if you're thinking this has got a lot of reading, Disco Elysium's got a shit ton of reading, and I don't want to like. It, every time I, I play it until I catch myself skimming, right. and then I stop playing mm -hmm. it. That's why it's taken me fucking ages to get yeah, through. Yeah, yeah. But that's a good rule, though. It's so good. <laughs> yeah. It's a good rule I to really stop enjoy. playing when you're not actually absorbing the game. Well, at yeah, all. yeah, yeah. And this is like I found myself like not just not absorbing some information, and then sort of getting just going off and not knowing what I'm doing. I'm like, oh, it's mm. because I didn't didn't read the thing from it, I wasn't paying attention. Mm. Yeah. Um, so you kind of do, yeah, you do need to sort of do the, read through it and, and try to absorb it as much as you can to get the most out of it at least. I really like that, um, oh, fuck, what's it called? Is it sword and sorcery or something? Mm. It's very similar, yeah. sort of like not, not s sort of similar vibe, I guess, but like more pixel -y yeah, sword and sorcery, that's sort it. sort of thing, yeah. I really loved that. Yeah, that's great. Um, so I keep thinking about this, well, I think think about that while I play this. I don't, I don't know. I'm just gonna like this game. I'm just gonna like it. Yeah. I like that it's like it seems like a an art project. I like that you know, I went to a gallery in the game. Yeah. I like the driving. I like that that changes, and I like yeah, that kind cool. of like when you hit this turn around. Like I like that kind of shit. It's yeah. just like I'm into it. I'm big time into that kind of. Let's go to a gallery and <laughs> explore meaning. But I don't know if it's this deep. I just I pounded through two hours of this and then I, had to stop. So I don't know. I assume Why? there's a lot of meaning in subtext. That stuff to do. That I, what do you have to do? What did you have to do? You got to write. You know, write what? Loner. I've got to do the second season of Loner. Oh. Ah, your excellent podcast. Thank Back you. Out of <laughs> podcast. I I like this game. I think I can appreciate it. It's not, but it isn't the sort of game that I really go for. Um, Say it, Evan! Because, uh, what? I don't like reading. No, no, oh. it's a fun game. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> That's not what I was saying. It's but a fun game? Yes! Hey! Um, Woo! It's, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if it, if it, it I... Not a know? fun game? Is it uh, not a fun game? Uh, fun wouldn't be a, a word that I would no. talk to. Yeah. Inter yeah. Like, interesting. Yeah, interesting and... Captivating. Yep, yeah, and 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 different. Um, it's been like it was one of the uh, inspirations for Disco Elysium. Like mm. it was because this has you know we're talking like nine years ago, yeah, or maybe seven years ago when it first that first act came out. It was actually um, a kind of revolutionary. Well, maybe revolutionary is a bit too strong, but at least it, you know it inspired a lot of people to to do similar sorts of things. I like how the click adventure and CRPGs are sort of coming back a little bit. I think it's nice. Yeah. And they're all finding new ways of differentiating themselves mm. uh, from each other, whether that's in art style or whether that's in narrative style or both. Or I like it. I love a CRPG. I find them or, or click adventure. I find them mm. relaxing, interesting, 
games to play. Sort of a different speed from your average, you know, run around, kill dogs. <laughs> yeah, that's more my speed. Yeah. Um, yeah. But I think I was that's why it wasn't fun. <laughs> I think as well, like, knowing that this is an old game that I'm only now just playing, it's like, well, I can't really be like, you guys, there's been heaps of shit. Like, you go, you're not making ground. Like, it's, like, right. you know. Well, because it doesn't say fuck Donald Trump. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> yeah, that was my main complaint about this, actually. <laughs> it's lack of politics. Uh, yeah. Fair enough. And actually, Kate is pro-Trump, so. Yeah. Pro-Trump. Pre pro Buddhadej. I'm both. Buddhadej. 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 I'm learning the dance. The Buddhadej dance. It's very easy to learn. How do you not have it down? Because I'm a bad dancer. With poor memory. The high hopes dance. Yeah, check your privilege. Is something going on, Beck? Oh, there's a spider on the camera. Oh, there's, there's a, a spider, spider, on, spider the on the camera. What kind of spider? I don't know. It disappeared. Like a little one or like a I'm going to fuck you up spider? No, like a little, I don't know. Like a little fucky? Yeah, a little fucky. A spider. <laughs> well, a little fucky. Maybe, that's a, maybe we should wrap up the show. That seems like a good uh, little, uh, yeah, a sign. The cameras have spiders on them. <laughs> we have to go. When the camera's got a spider on it, it's time to finish the show. Um, but of course, before we uh, before we wrap up the show, we have a Patreon question. Uh huh. Wow. Um, that happens every week. Sorry. <laughs> uh, the uh, the top voter question this week was from Rawasaw Land. Yes. As Battle Royale starts to fade away, what do you think is the next bi- next big game genre? Let's go. Can I? I'm going to read that again. It's fading um, away. No. Yes. Yeah. As Battle Royale starts to fade away, it's starting to fade away. It hasn't faded away yet. Um, what do you think the next big game genre is going to be and why? Well, my question, to answer that question with a question, why would you think that we would know <laughs> anything? Because <laughs> we're uh, gaming industry commentators. Gaming industry commentators? <laughs> is that how you see yourself? No. <laughs> I am a man of import. <laughs> no. Um, Certainly not. Mm, I don't have an answer. And I'm panicking. Um, ben? I oh. think uh, Just Dance is going to take a big comeback. <laughs> start, it could. Uh, Just Dance and yep. Call of uh, Duty will add a Sing Just Dance Star mode. is going to come back. Call of Duty, will, you'll be able to play with your Sing Star microphone. Yeah. I It'll think it's going to be. Well, like sing in a certain tone to go yeah. left. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that's killing dogs. Bang, bang, bang. Shoot yeah. Gun. I think that's going to be a big That'd one. So buy up stocks in Sing Star now. Okay. Um, I mean, I don't know. Uh, just trying to think of what's sort of trending and whatnot. It's kind VR, of VR. Is VR finally gonna gonna be uh, everything? I don't know. Half Life Alex VR. is gonna come out uh, March twenty third. So that I think is gonna be a real big boom uh, to the VR world. And in fact, was it last month? I think was the the biggest growth <laughs> period in in VR. Yeah, I mean, it's tough. It's like every year you're like, oh, what's gonna be the big, you know, drink. Yeah, you know, a couple of years ago it was an Aperol Spritz. A mm. couple of years before that, it was a fucking espresso martini. Yeah, mm. what you is know? the next drink? What is the next drink? Are we going to see, you know, a resurgence of some like, I don't know, is it going to be gin? Is it going to be tequila? It's my is prediction. It be whiskey. Just really good wine. Yeah, not that expensive, but actually everyone getting into grapes. <laughs> grapes. <laughs> <Okay>. and- <laughs> You heard it first. And I think that's going to be echoed back into the game. So I think grapes, <laughs> grapes are going to be huge. We're talking massive grapes, grapes as big as your head. Yeah, also, right. also grapes, little grapes. Yeah, tiniest grapes. So, and there's no going to be real in between. We're going to be seeing big or tiny grapes. And you'll be like, I just want normal sized grapes. And I'm like, you need to grow up, okay? It's 2020 or 2021. Mm. Depending on whether we're in the future, in which case it could be we're 20 not in the future. Well, we'll be in the we past. Be. Yeah, we could. Well, we not in the past. Right. We now. will be if someone's watching this in 2021. We'll be in the past. We're in the past right now when people are watching this because that's in the future. Not me. I'm on Tazo time. <laughs> <laughs> So, and you're just really anxious? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and don't you fucking touch me on my head. Don't you fucking touch me on my head. Uh, Belly is fine. <laughs> and I think ro- role-playing games will continue to get huge. Yeah? I mean, you've already seen them pretty much gamify every other 
genre with RPG elements. Yeah. And uh, I think they'll just continue to get... People fucking love them. And it, 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 as the technology gets better, you can kind of do more. Sims, look out. Sims 5, I reckon. It's about time for I reckon new it's Sims. about yeah. time for Sims 5. Yeah. Do we yeah. need it? You're going to see a Sims 5? Consoles. I feel like it's that thing, though, where it's like, we don't know what really... Fuck! Here, take you? this one. Thank you. I want to see more AAA games where you're not just fighting people all the time. That's what I want to see. Yeah. yeah. Where it's actually more interesting and not just battling shit. Right. Boo! That's what I want to see. I think instead of Battle Royale, you're going to be running around maps uh, trying to jerk people off. <laughs> Digital, not real people, but jerking. Yeah, you'll right. come across and you have to jerk them off. And I wonder if we'll see more free games like Apex Legends and PUBG and Fortnite Battle Royale. Like, mm. I think that, that'll probably continue because it's obviously a very successful model if you can get into the zeitgeist. And of is course, in-app purchases? Is that all they're making money yeah. off? Yeah, yeah, you buy a new dance Microtransactions. Yes, microtransactions. Sort of uh, That's so micro in the end, right? <laughs> uh, no, if they're yeah, bloody wrong. wrong. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be seeing Anthem next, which is yeah. going to revolutionize gaming. Games that have to be released twice because they were broken the first time around. <laughs> Imagine. Fallout 76. That's fucking Anthem. wild. <laughs> I don't know. Destiny. If... Yeah, Destiny wasn't released again, was it? Destiny 2. Well, they kept sort of, they, they iterated it. Yeah. But I don't know if a game has been like, I can't think of... I mean, you think of No Man's Sky, but that was like, oh, yeah, we're going to keep working on it. But Anthem is like, oh, no, this was so bad, we're going to redesign this. Yeah, page. yeah. <laughs> but, uh, uh, why? Put it in the bin. Well, yeah. I mean, they've sunk a lot of money into developing, that's I guess, not, the, what it is. That's not a uh, gamer's fault. We should <laughs> not be forced in to get another get Anthem. No <laughs> one should be forced to see Anthem ever again. Amen. All right. I'm interested to see what they do with it, but who knows? I'm sure it'll be really good. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what was that? I think, I think <laughs> Anthem, uh, uh, Fallout 77, it's gonna be huge. <laughs> All the good games. If, uh, if you have a question you'd like us to answer on the show, uh, you can do so through the Patreon, jump on the $10 tier. Um, if you do it this month, you'll get a you get a, an enamel pin. Uh, Twelve dollars, you can do all that, and you get a mug as well. And at twenty dollars, you get your name right on the show, which uh, we'll uh, we'll do now. Ah, uh, we'll, we'll read timing's some perfect. Names. Um, our, our big patrons, we uh, we we thank uh, Adam Jam Batista, one Alan of the Lowell. biggest patrons. Oh, so big. Amy G, Ben Lovett, Cameron McCorris, Shemeth Wajratney, Chandler the Bakerman, Christian Ford, Christian Zuchis, <laughs> Chris Cheeky, David Cunningham, Dale Ball just joined. Uh, Ooh, but what? Why? Why won't he talk? <laughs> Dale Ball! Why won't he talk? What Did are you see? hiding, Dale yeah, Ball? Yeah, what is Dale Ball hiding? Let's get to that <laughs> mystery. What is he, Dale Ball's secret? He, um, maybe he's working on a cake. He, you know, whatever. A cake. He, well, he, when he said he, he joined the well, Discord, he said case? it. case? Cake. No. No, he <laughs> he's meant He's not cake. a detective. He's um, a baker. Yeah, that would be ridiculous. <laughs> That would be Kate. ridiculous. He's probably He's not a baker. He's making a cake. No. no, that's Chandler the baker man. Ah. The baker, you <laughs> fucking d- idiot. <laughs> he said when he joined the Discord, it suggested it would, it, he'd bake a cake. And so he said maybe he'd make a gamey, gamey, game cake. Dave anyway. Ball did. Yes. I thought he said he didn't say anything. No, he didn't say anything. He said I this am. in a message to me. So he did say something. What? Oh, so he's talking to you privately. Not, not on Discord. He on won't Patreon, go public. No. What? I don't see anything wrong with that. I think he's getting a bad rap, and I'm sorry, Dale, for being persecuted by the biggest bully, and that is Evan. I'm not a bully. The bully, the bully becomes the bully. The bully becomes the bully. <laughs> the bully the bullied. Hang on. Oh, the bully. Hang on. Okay. So a fan of the show yes. joined the Discord and the Patreon and then yeah. messaged you directly and said, Hey, Evan, <laughs> I'm going to bake you a cake. He he messaged me about something else. We we're having. Don't eat it. Don't eat it. <laughs> Do you sound like Elvis? Hey, um, <laughs> I'm gonna make you a cake. Yeah. Oh. Let's uh. Um, no. Oh, we'll, we'll crack on with the names. There's. Um, I'm gonna marry a seventeen-year-old. Oh. There is Heisner. stuff in that cake. That's uh, what I was Don't eat the cake. Drew Schuller, Eric Stacy, Jack ah. Mufati, James Cameraman. Jack, like your fatty. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Jamil Noaz, who uh, just joined this week as well. Uh, oh, Carly yes. Jones, Lachlan Chapman, Matthew Ryan, Nathan Bauer, uh, Nesto. Uh, how did you pronounce this? 
Which one? Guijaro. I don't know exactly. N Nestor Guijaro? Nestor Guijaro. Let us know in the comments uh, if that's if that's right, Nestor. Um, and thanks for joining us this week. Uh, Paul Barbie Rawasaw, uh, Scott Chapman, Sean Prague, oh, Soph Waldron, so nice. Stephen Burke, and Zach Steinbecker. Thank you. Uh, if you want to hear your name right on the show, uh, you can jump on the $20 here, as I said. It's patreon.com slash gamergame or gamergame.com slash Patreon. Um, or you can send join me up. $15. Or the name or is $15. Or me $20 and I'll write I think that was one of the ones that were, did give you the $15, but then decided to do the legitimate thing uh, and sign up to the $20 here on the Game. Game. So Thank people you have sent you $15? Huh? I don't want to comment on that. <laughs> This is bullshit. <laughs> um, and uh, yes, you want to find out how it works? You send me fifteen dollars. We'll set it up, baby. Do you have one of those online wish lists? Um, no, because I refuse to support Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's so brave of you. Thank you. So I You're get so people brave. to buy me well, stuff from other places. Yeah, while you drink your coke. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. <laughs> uh, well, get yourself the pin. Get yourself the mug. Join the join the Patreon. It's fun. People talk on the Discord, except for Dale. Uh, but everyone else goes on and has. You fucking has hate this guy, I don't hate man. Him. No, I don't hate him at all. Um, so I very much appreciate supporting the show. Um, and uh, and if you enjoy the show, of course you can subscribe to our channel. We're getting close to five thousand, but man, it's really it's a really <laughs> slowed down. Uh, getting up to that milestone. Ugh. I think um, you know. This will encourage people to. Stick it's very like if, stick you know around. the people who watch the show are very supportive, um, but people aren't, people, people aren't. It's not discoverable. I don't know what the. Well, why aren't you sharing it with your friends and family and loved ones? Yeah, I keep telling people to share it with your your friends. I'm sure this is a very easy show to sell to people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Honey, I don't want you going on YouTube anymore. <laughs> Why can't you just watch old ride videos like all the other kids? <laughs> <laughs> um, you can also podcast the show. Uh, just search for us on uh, whatever podcast app you use. Um, that's all for this week. Evan uses Pocket Cast. <laughs> I oh, I do too. Oh, well, great. What do you use? Google Podcasts. Really? Ow! What about Spotify? They've shown 200% oh. uh, growth in Love this. Let me tell you, if you got Spotify, whatever you do, if you listen to it for music, don't listen to one podcast because it will fuck up your whole scrolling experience. Wow. Yeah. Mm. It's all or nothing with you. It's either a big grape or a little grape. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's, right. all, that's, that's, that's all for the, uh, this week. Good God. Um, we, uh, we'll, we'll catch you. <laughs> <laughs> we'll catch you next week. We'll do it. We'll do a. We'll do a, a different uh, next week. Or maybe it won't be so hot. Who knows? Um, I fucking hope not. <laughs> it's so hot here. Yeah, guys. it's sweaty. It's, it's like a. It's give up hot. Yeah. <laughs> and that's what you've seen. <laughs> it's got um, a real armpit kind of. It's like cross between an armpit and like a. <laughs> it's humid. Vagina. It is. It it's is humid. Really wet. It is. It's got a real vaginal. <laughs> Vibe to it. So maybe it'll leave a different sort of a vibe next week. Very yeah. thrushy in here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> this person has not been taken care it of. It hasn't shit. been aired out. No. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, they need to, they've been wearing, wearing too much rayon. Rayon? Yeah, mm. Sitting on office desk chairs. <laughs> <laughs> we, uh, we'll catch you next Long. week. Bye. Get naked. Bye. <laughs>